Hey guys, it's Tyler here, and to be honest with you, I actually didn't think this would happen, but it did. So you might know that video from earlier, um, where I did the unboxing on the um, Elf on the Shelf reindeer, and I said at the end of the video, if it got up to um, two or three likes, then I read the story, you know? And then um, I checked it had one like, then when I checked again, it had two. So... As you guys can probably tell, today we're going to be reading the story because it got two likes. So, um, yeah, so the story's called Elf Pets, A Reindeer Tradition by Chanda A. Bell. So, let's get right into it. Because there's a lot of pages in this book. Like, I, I'm assuming there's a lot of pages. All right. I will show you the um, writing and pages at the end, but let's just get into it. Where the moon gently cast a bright bluish glow and the forest was wrapped in a new fallen snow, the animals gathered to see for themselves the takeoff and landing of Santa's scout elves. So guys, there's the writing. Here's the picture. Each elf on the shelf it, in its red and white suit leaped and spun round with each trump, trumpeter's toot and drum beats, beats sound, resounded with rat-a-tat-tat. -tat, while elves in the air flew this way and that. Oh, guys, I almost forgot to show you the picture. So there's the writing. Here's the picture. All creatures and critters, no matter their size, marveled at what they just seen with their eyes. They all seemed to know how special it is to work for Chris Cringle and hang out with kids. So guys, there's the writing. And here's the picture. The animals turned to the stable nearby. A crash could be heard and a faint little cry. Out the door they all tumbled like dice in a game. Twas the n nine mighty reindeer, each known by his name. Above all their heads the sleigh flew through the air, then landed kerplunk right next to a bear. So guys, there's that writing, and then there's that writing. Here's the picture. Santa turned to his side, shook his head with regret. Let's try this again. We can't give up yet. The elf stood in silence. The animals did too. The sleigh was not flying. What could they do? The reindeer tried harder. The elf's eyes grew round, but the sleigh did not budge. Not an inch off the ground. Christmas spirit is needed to make the sleigh soar. Santa said with a sadness they'd not heard before. There's that writing, and there's that writing. Here's the picture. In the blink of an eye, the sleigh lifted midair. Someone believed Santa noticed with care, noted with care. Sorry, guys. And then it's, there's a sign right there that says um, Santa. But people probably won't count that, but... All right, so there's that writing, and then there's that flag that says Santa, and then there's the picture. All right. It lasted a moment, then back to the ground. Thump, the sleigh hit. The elves glanced around. Santa looked to the stable, and right through the door stood thousands of reindeer pawing, pawing the floor. So guys, there's the writing. And then here, we have the picture. At once they stepped forward, as if to say, Santa choose us to help pull the sleigh. Santa chuckled and said, my friendly elf pets, this task would be big, as big as it gets. The scout 
elves then shouted, don't count them out. They're like, they're tiny like us, but we have no doubt. The kids would adopt them and give them a name. They'll treat them like us, one and the same. So guys, here we have that writing and then that writing, and there's the picture. Santa listened to stories the scout elves recounted, all the moments of faith, hope, and love they'd encountered. White out on wild out on assignment, the big and the small proved the spirit of Christmas was alive after all. Perhaps with more reindeer and faith, that is true, we'll build Christmas magic to help the sleigh through the dangers that often stand in the way of delivering presents by Christmas Day. So, guys, there's that writing and that writing. There's the picture. Santa turned to, to the reindeer and stretched out his arm. In his palm, he revealed a tiny heart charm. The hope of all children who believe in their heart in the magic of Christmas will make my sleigh start. So guys, there's the writing and it's a picture. Wear this, wear this charm proudly for people to see. It should serve to, it should serve to remind them your mission, missions for me. Let them hold you and love you as much as they can. This heart holds your magic. Do you understand? <clears throat> Do you, you see? It's not fragile, not like an elf. Your goal's not the same to watch from a shelf. Your job is to snuggle and nestle up tight, to store up the wonder that makes my, me take flight. Like there's that writing and that writing, and there's a picture. The night before Christmas, once sleep has come, the sleigh will approach and you will become a fully grown reindeer brilliant and grand while magic swirls softly like wind blown like wind blown sand okay so there's the writing there's the picture you'll say your goodbyes then you'll leap for the door with love from your heart you'll lift off the floor up up through the air you'll sail and you'll twirl, happy for time spent with each boy and girl. So guys, there's the writing, and there's the picture. We'll meet on the roof, and you'll take your place as part of the team that makes my sleigh race over the rooftops and high above mountains, crossing the rivers, we'll dance over fountains. My sleigh will bring joy on Christmas Eve, thanks to each reindeer and kids who believe. So guys, there's that writing and that writing. There's the picture. Yeah guys, and then this part says we welcome our elf pets reindeer on 12 1 which is obviously um december 1st 2019 we choose the name and i named it ninja so sorry if you guys don't like that name should have had some just suggestions for what i should name it let's see look at this ninja's what we name ninja's what i name my l and then if you guys want to pause and read about the author. What does this say? Christmas spirit is needed to make the sleigh soar. So you guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. We read, where we read Elf Pets by Chanda A. Bell. 
so if you guys i'm probably gonna like i don't know what i'm gonna upload next but let's get some support on this video and just like always i will see you in the next one peace out